We have an awesome campus. We have over seven acres of campus located on the waterfront, Southport Townsend Bay, but we have also five individual shops. We have a systems shop, boat building shops. We also have a metal shop. And the beauty of having all of these in one facility is we can build anything. To start from, this is how you sharpen a chisel, to this is how you use a Japanese handsaw, to all of a sudden you're making your own tools, and then you're using those tools to then build a boat. It's a rapid program. In three months, we're building boats. So this is where you'd want to come to learn that in, in an accelerated fashion. The school's mission is teaching and preserving craftsmanship. We do that through boat building. We build all kinds of boats. We build plank on frame, lap strake, all different kinds of wood composite boats. Boats from eight to 30 feet in all different construction styles, all different uses, power, sail, row. I think the school provides students with an amazing foundation and a really good stepping off point. Um, and one thing that is driven home to me is the lack of ego that all of our instructors have and the idea that you're leaving the school with a good armament of knowledge. We are learning, we are practicing as much as we can in a very short amount of time with an amazing resource at hand. So I think not just the skills the school has provided, but the leadership that all of the instructors and their approach to students. Like, hey, I can tell you all the things you want and you can choose to remember them or not because one day you're gonna have to change it. There's always an exception to the rule. One of the primary skills we teach throughout the programs at the school is problem solving. We're showing you how to take very complex shapes and take those shapes and problem solve through the construction of that boat. And along that way, you're inherently building all these other skills you didn't know you had. So it's not only working with your hands to build a boat, but it's problem solving through the different things that come up there. It's unpredictable. And so you're learning a whole new skill set when you come here. And that skill set doesn't just apply to boat building, it applies to all the trades. One of the biggest things I've been taking away from the school is that I can go to any yard as long as I am open and calm and like willing to learn what they're doing. Because I have gotten an amazing background here, I've got an amazing foundation, I've had experiences, and I'm gonna continue to have experiences that are completely fundamental to my career. I grew up in Aspen, Colorado. I was born there, and when I started high school, I had a, a shop class, and I started getting really interested in boats, and I started building them. And one day in shop class, we had a substitute teacher. I was working on the boat, and he said to me, he was like, you should look into wooden boat building schools. I was like, well, interesting. I, I, mean, I didn't know about that. And so I went and I, I looked, and this was the first school that I clicked on. I saw it and I was like, okay, I'm going there. I took the boat building class and I was working on the boat, the Rosinante. I started us on framing the deck. And there were over a hundred pieces to the deck frame. Once it had a deck on it, then I went over to help frame the cabin top. Then I moved on to the companionway hatch. I talked to Leland a bit and he let me have some input on how to do that. Got to design it and then we would agree on it and then I got to build it. The students learn right alongside the instructors. The instructors are also learning how to problem solve along the way. So it's more of a real world problem solving skill set. It was really great to see something that I had actually had some input on be built and then work out. I came here really just interested in the woodworking. And then when I got here, I found out about the systems and I was like, oh, there's even more. We bring you in with the assumption you have little to no experience and we take you all the way through from basic crimping all the way up to your wiring complete electrical systems. Isolation transformers, inverters, AC-DC distribution panels, the whole process. Everything you find on a boat today. Instead of bringing his DC negative well, here. And yeah, and the negative is a smaller size. I'm excited about the systems program because there is a shortage of qualified technicians in the marine trades. Diesel systems, hydraulics, plumbing, electrical experts, there's not enough of them. So we've hired a number of alumni from the Northwest School of Wooden Boat Building, both from the systems program and from the woodworking side. I'm really excited about Damien. He's kind of that next generation. He's able to do a lot of things right away as soon as we hired him. 
and he comes with a lot of curiosity. So he wants to know why we do stuff the way we do it, and so that he can generalize that knowledge to, to, the, to the next project. He's now doing a full rewire on this 36-foot sloop. Our goal is for our students to leave with the competencies that they need to enter the diversified marine workplace. It's easy to look at a boat's lines and think of an adventure or to think of something that just moves your heart. Um, and I think that's what I wasn't getting in science. I came out here and I found a chance to do something that was different and gratifying and real. I know you're going to do good things. I want to say just how grateful I am to this school. They'll take somebody who has never picked up a tool and a few short months I feel like I could take on anything. There's a lot of jobs out there and people are really keen to have talent from the boat school. Right out of school I got a job rewiring this boat in McClure Bay and it needs a complete rewire done and I'm leading the project. I'm outside right by the water working on boats and it's really exciting. My whole life I've wanted to be a woodworker. I just kind of decided I had to jump in to something. So I went, took a tour, and I just fell in love. It was just so alive. Everyone's working with their hands and their minds. Probably one of the better decisions of my life. School gave me purpose. One quote I really like is, happiness comes from solving problems. And the boat building is problem solving. And so for me, it was a really good way to learn how to use the tools in a safe environment. And so how much confidence I built over that time was transformational. Like, okay, maybe I can do this. Rock on, crouton. When I started seriously considering the boat school, I wanted something that was artistic and you work with your hands and, you know, creative, but structural and they give me that direction that I think I'm missing in my life. The boat school just far surpassed all my expectations. The fact that they were so welcoming and meet you where you're at created a really nice environment to thrive in. And I started realizing there's, there's a science to this and there's, there's an art to it. And three months into the program, I started going down the small craft field. We were creating a replica of a 1948 Whitehall. And I got to see that all from start to finish, which was really, really rewarding and a great educational experience. The night of graduation, Todd from Cape George Marine Works he called me and offered me the job. I was ecstatic to find out that I would be working in the field. He showed me some good skills and, uh, and some good background knowledge and a lot of enthusiasm, which is of course the principal requirement. I got this project to make a bowsprit for the Cape George 38 cutter. I used the existing bowsprit and made some improvements on its design and I got to work right away on milling up the Alaskan yellow cedar and laminating it, and I made the one you see here. The boat school brings a level of competency right off the bat that we can use as a building block to, to make boat builders. If I didn't take the chance to go to the school, I, I wouldn't be here. Really exciting.